So guys, please mention this video um, if you want to get 50% off your next fit here at Pure Form Golf. Uh, I'd recommend it guys, 50% off would uh, do a world of good for your game. Hi, I'm Alan Staines from Aussie Golf Reviewer here at Pure Form Golf and we're going to take an in-depth look at the precision fitting that they do here. Alright, we're over at the Lie Loft machine here guys, and a lot of people think that a custom fitting is just length Lie Loft. Where is that wrong? What, um, how is that wrong? Okay, so when we, when we go through a fitting here at Pure Form, right, shaft is a, is a major uh, role play as to what we do. Yes, Lie Lofts are important as well, but when you look at someone's profile on how they hit a golf ball, right, um, shaft profiling and how the shaft then bends, and droops through impact. Correct. So as it not only not only does it then load that way, it also loads this way. Downwards. You then look at how the toe will impact, you know, onto the turf and, and golf ball. Yes. A different shaft profile will droop differently. Therefore, so it's... the dynamic lie through impact can change. We got to make sure that we find the right shaft that fits you, and then adjust from there. Adjust from there. Just because with one club you're square or standard the next shaft you might be one flat yeah. or a quarter up so it does make a difference but it's not the first thing we look at so not not the be all and end all of, a, of a custom club fit correct right, so i just wanted to really show you then how a shaft bends through impact okay so when we look at a golf shaft and it sits square this way um, and someone's making a swing it bends it'll bend that way right which is like this okay but it also bends this way through impact Right, so as you make a swing, it is bending like that. If we then look at it, how it shaft through the head, notice how the toe sits further down. What that means, right, is that you're gonna hit more toe side. So you get something that plays a little softer, you can also then have to make it more upright to square up the face or impact. Uh, pure form was amazing. The experience was amazing. I think the biggest thing that I found is, will fit me into a set of irons that I've currently got. Um, which is it? I fitted myself. The thing is, with the pured shafts and the flow, the flat line oscillation of the shafts made it feel so much better and my numbers were so much more consistent. So it just proves that I was using the right clubs and the right shafts with the right specs. It's just with what they do here at Pure Form with the uh, precision fitting, uh, makes it so much more consistent and that, that blew me away. Um, and then also done an Edel putter fit which was phenomenal. Basically went from my blade putter to a slightly malleted putter with no offset and my speed was better, my aim was better, um, my alignment was better, everything was better. All right guys, now we're in the putting lab here with Will um, testing out some putters and I come down to do an Edel putter fitting and we're getting somewhere close to where we need to be for my aim. <clears throat> Sorry guys, um, different head shapes, Will. It's getting me to aim slightly different. Yeah, so when we look at putters, right, we look at a whole bunch of different things, okay? Um, obviously, you know, the current putter shape that you're using, uh, very standard, Newport looking, uh, you know, one shaft offset, single line on the back, you know, very simple, right? Yeah. Uh, in this case, because it's got that offset and that line and a very small face blade, right, blade sole, um, you actually aim left. Um, in the case that when we look at the head shape, uh, using the Adele fitting system, right, we're going to go more towards something more mallet looking with no lines for aiming, okay, uh, because then that allows you to aim straighter, right. We then look at loft, so in this case two degrees, um, and that two degrees allows you to bring that, um, you know, that loft a little bit higher to give yourself a better roll. Uh, from there, then we look at hosels, and in this case, no offset. So when we're looking at hosels, you can see the hosel head shape, right, hosel shape, sorry, where there's more offset to less offset. In the case here, right, we want to look at a putter that has very little, in actual fact, no offset. So in the case of no offset for Alan, it allows him to actually aim a little bit more right. Uh, because with the standard putter, right, and you look at it's got more offset on it, right, that more offset 
allows him to aim left, which is where he's aiming. So when we look at then less offset, he actually starts aiming square, further right from the original aim. And certainly, it, uh, as a visual, it, it looks very different to me to look down at no offset. But when it comes down to the aim, will it, it, it actually works. Yes. So changing the neck, changing the shape of the head, uh, it has the bearing on aim. Yes. Which is the most important part of a putter. Correct. Face is all that matters. That's right. So guys, please mention this video um, if you want to get 50% off your next fit here at Pure Form Golf. Uh, I'd recommend it guys, 50% off would uh, do a world of good for your game.